You did at one point say we're going to do 42 of these, didn't you? Hey, welcome to week five, day number two. Okay, once again, great graphics. Love this. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Jackie. I love it. You know what? I had these ideas and she made them come true. I love this. All right. It's often says that no news is good news. Well, in today's day and age, let me tell you something, we are on information overload between the internet and phones and all this stuff coming at us. I have a big theory about this. If you're trying to change your life and do something, turn off the news. Ooh, I know, how dare you? Turn off the local news. Local news is never good news. Unless it's about your family and you need to know it, there's usually somebody who's gotten hit or hurt or killed. I don't, it's never very good news. If it bleeds, it leads. That doesn't add value to your life. And if you're someone who spends a lot of time listening to that, don't. It instills your whole body with negativity. And what's our goal for this entire process? Becoming a positive, focused, mindset-driven, eating, breathing, fun human being. <laughs> Turn off the news. Trust me on this one. But I do want you to do is describe a current event, something that actually is affecting you emotionally, good or bad. Is there some worldwide event that you are finding touches you that you would like to express right here. Two things it serves. One is it kind of serves as a marker that wherever you are in time and space that you're doing this, something is happening. Is it uh, some war that might be going on, some good deed? I don't really know. Here's my, my, my news, and, and I love this one. There's something right now going on in the internet. A friend of mine's mom just died from ALS. It's a horrible disease called Lou Gehrig's disease, and, it just, and I watched her, and I've watched videos of other people, and I feel my heart breaks. I knew about this for a long time, unfortunately. Well, on the internet, there was a thing called the Ice Bucket Challenge to promote the awareness of ALS. And people, everybody, from celebrities to the heads of state are pouring buckets of ice on their head. I love how this is spreading around. It's become a worldwide phenomenon. Notice, I didn't have to turn on the news to get this one. But it makes me smile. It makes me smile that we're living in this information age where you can get good news. You can inspire. You can do something this viral, this positive. They've raised millions of dollars over pouring ice on your head. I think this is awesome. So that's what I wrote about. What is your favorite news event going on? Maybe, you know what, make it something positive. See if you can find something. Go ahead. <laughs> 